Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Um, it is Ayana Hanaya, and today we are at my salon. Um, number one, you see us, we're watching Netflix, a show called Hard Times. Okay, fast forward. So right now I'm braiding down her hair. Um, you'll see in all of my videos, coming up in the future anyway, that everybody's braid pattern is different. It just depends on what hairstyle they're getting, if they want to wear it pulled up or leave it down, um, their head size and um how long they're leaving it in like if they plan to leave it in for just three or four weeks or four to eight weeks it all varies this last little piece i'm gonna sew it down i know some people um just pull the crochet needle through and lock it in but i'm always scared that it's gonna fall apart so i just sew it down just to be extra sure okay so the hair we're using is the go go curl pattern by free Tress. And um, we use four packs and cut it in half. Alexis likes her hair to be shoulder length and she likes it to be nice and full and she likes it to be cut and styled in a way where all she has to do is get up and go. So the four packs gives it the fullness without me having to separate the hair because sometimes when you separate the hair after you wear it for uh, you know about a week or so it kind of flattens out and you know use different approaches for different clients like this particular client whom I love um, she wants what's easy and what she doesn't have to really you know maintain so when you separate the pieces in my opinion it's more to maintain I know for me because I wear crochet myself whenever I do an install on myself and I separate the hair it seems like it's more frizzier it's more maintenance it's just more for me to do but I use less packs which saves money but then when I install the crochet um, in my hair and I don't separate the packs I leave them whole I might use more packs however it lasts longer and then as time goes on I can separate it if I want to to give it a bigger even fuller look or I can kind of cut some out to thin it out but to me it just lasts a little longer when you leave the hair whole so the four packs cut in half kind of gives you basically eight packs um, of hair but you'll see at the end that it actually ends up looking nice and full and not like it's too much hair okay so working my way from the bottom up I really like the braids going straight back um, right in the, the back of the center of her head because it makes it lay really flat um, for certain curl patterns I don't like this braid pattern because when you laugh or move your head or talk the hair may separate and you can see scalp and that's something that I hate is to see scalp however for how close I actually put them in her hair and for how many packs we use in this one you can't tell also um, with the braids going straight back if she's to get her hair wet or something and her um, braids loosen up a little bit it's, it leaves a little more wiggle room basically sometimes when you braid horizontally which is my favorite braid pattern by the way um, and your hair gets wet then your braids kind of get a little soggy and fall down some and it makes the style sag a little bit if that makes sense um, but with this one it doesn't so anyway choose your braid pattern for you know whatever crochet style you're doing make it work for you like I said I use a bunch of different braid patterns side note I used to suck at braiding I still kind of suck at braiding my braids are not always super pretty um, but I mean I used to like quadruple suck at braiding and now I don't super side note this episode of hard times was or hard time no s was crazy they found this $50 bill in this guy's cell and they're like is this your $50 bill and he's like no I've never seen that before one of the, the CEOs put that in my room and then when Discovery interviews him after and they're like so who do you think planted the $50 bill he goes that was my $50 bill I, I wasn't about to tell them that and we started cracking up we're like they are they really in here living well you know like trying to live but like wow you know what I'm saying crazy anyway as you can see um, with me not separating the hair the curls are really pretty it's nice and full you can't see through to her scalp um, and I really love this color on her 
one time we did uh, I think it was a 1B and a 33 mix and it was nice but I like the um, I like the browns on her the best So again, this video is a little bit longer because I was asked to make a video where you could actually see in depth how I install a crochet. So I will make another video with me um, installing a crochet and make it a little bit lengthier as well and use a completely different braid pattern and different hair so that way you can have some options. So fast forward, this guy on the TV right now, um, he murdered somebody and he's in there acting like he shouldn't be in prison. And he's like, you know, it just doesn't make any sense that they'll basically take my life away and I can't do anything all day. I have to just live in a cell. It's just not fair that, you know, I have to be in here and suffer like this. And I'm like, you killed somebody. And it wasn't like a self-defense or, you know, like somebody hurt his baby. Not saying that, that those are reasons to kill anybody, but I'm just saying. He was just like just a cold blood killer and he's mad he has to be in jail. Anyway, back to the hair. So you can see this is the perfect back view where you can see by cutting it in half and, um, you know, starting from the bottom and working your way up. It already starts to give it the layers, so at the end, I really won't have to do that much cutting. I'll just frame the face a little bit, and the back, I'll just snip off a little loose ends and probably just round it out some. But the back is nice and full. There's nothing to see through. Um, I love the little specks of highlight. Okay, so here's the thing, you'll have to forgive me. My camera records up to 26 minutes and I did not realize that it had cut off so I didn't get to readjust it to show you the part. But this is the finished product. Um, she loved her hair. It's her go-to hairstyle. And it looks really pretty on her. I just cut a little bit in the front and you can see the back is nice and full. The sides are nice and full. The front is nice and full too, and it's cut in some pretty curly layers. It frames her face and looks good. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, don't forget to like and share and subscribe and comment. Email me if you need to. Um, let me know if you have any questions. And um, if you'd like to book an appointment, if you're in Georgia, then visit my website and book. Follow me on Instagram, all that great stuff. All right, you guys, thanks so much. Bye. Yeah.